Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you what I got from Sephora. So for Sephora right now is having 20% off discount for 10 days and for the first 6 days is for VIB Rook and right now for VIB Rook you can get 1.5 points for every dollar that you spend compared to 1 to 1 before. Usually there are a couple of times where Sephora has a 15% discount or 20% discount and that's the time where I stock up my makeup and skincare. Uh, so I'm going to show you what is my holy grail makeup and skincare. So without further ado, I'm going to show you what I got. First thing is my skincare. I usually use this moisturizer. It's from Fras and they have so many kind of moisturizer and I like the Lotus one. Face Lotus Youth Preserve Face Cream with Super 7 Compact. And I use this for a couple uh, years already and I really love it. It's light, it's not too expensive. I like the rose one better for the smell, but I think when I put it on my face, I can see a better result if I use the Lotus one. So that's why I keep buying over and over again. I think I bought like more than 10 bottles already for this one. And uh, next, I think this one is pretty new. It's from Fras. It's Vitamin Nectar. It says Moisturizer Glow face cream and I try it and I smell it I kind of like it so that's why I'm thinking to give it a try I bought it in Canada so it's five dollar more expensive than the Lotus one but I thought I'm just gonna give it a try so I can compare whether I will change my moisturizer to this one or I'm going to keep using the Lotus one I still have my serum so I didn't buy that one but for the serum I usually use Lancome Genefic I usually buy the big bottle because it's more uh, worth it that way for primer I love this one I tried a couple of primer already I tried the one from Smashbox Makeup Forever I like this one better it's called the Pore Professional it's from Benefit uh, it smells really nice because I use this every time if I use foundation so I thought I'm just gonna buy the big bottle I can see the difference if I use this one and if I don't use this one so I can tell that if I use the primer my makeup will last longer so for foundation I have used this one for a couple years already I use the double wear um, stay in place foundation from Estee Lauder and my shade is Tawny Especially if you have like special occasion uh, wedding that you're going to go to or dinner, it's really nice and stay in place. Last on, I've been using this for a couple years as well. It's NARS, it's Orgasm, and I tried the Super Orgasm. I don't really like that one. I like the Orgasm better. It's like peachy color. Next, I have this uh, powder. So some people like to use loose powder. But I'm not a big fan because for me it's messy and I just don't have time to clean it. And if I tap the brush, it's like everywhere, so I don't really like it. But recently I found this one. I think I've started using it from last year. It's Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. Instead of using this, I usually like to use a brush and I just brush it on my T-zone so I don't sweat that easy. Sometimes I also put it under my eye. So I'm gonna show you this one. I started using this one from last year as well. For me, it's kind of pricey but I think it works if I'm in a hurry because right now I have a baby so sometimes I need something that quick and if I go to mommy group, if I need to go to science world and I just don't have time to do my makeup. So I just use moisturizer and on top of that, I can use this. Basically, it's a BB cushion but what I like about it is it comes with SPF 50 sunscreen so I don't have to use sunscreen anymore if I use this one and it also comes with an extra refill but it's kind of pricey but I keep buying it right now because it just worked for my busy schedule last but not least is this one usually I bought a cream one instead of the spray but this one is SPF 50 plus and ultra sun protection spray and you can use it for face and bodies and my husband can use it as well there's a mixed review about it so I'm kind of afraid whether to buy it or not but I think for the price it's okay and that it's water resistant as well for 80 minutes so I'm gonna give it a try pouch from Sephora uh, it's not too bad. There's a confetti on it. I am a Sephora addict before. I usually buy a lot of makeup palette, eyeshadow palette, but I just don't have time to do a full makeup every day. So I just keep buying the stuff that I use over and over like every day. So I hope you find this video useful. And if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.